Now, the governor says what happened here is frustrated and distressing, and she is working on it. She also says she hopes to have an update soon on the search for a new GM. Inspections ongoing in the days since a 25 pound ceiling panel fell to the floor at the Harvard T stop, narrowly missing a woman on the platform. It's the latest in a long line of troubling incidents at the T. I understand for riders out there to see yet another incident is incredibly uh, distressing, frustrating. I do want people to know that we are on it. We are working hard every day to get the resources to where they need to be. Crews removed more than 140 panels from the ceiling of the southbound platform at the Harvard stop alone. It comes as the T announced the Federal Transit Administration approved one of the 38 corrective action plans needed to address widespread problems. We're paying close attention right now to the FTA report and responding to that. And I can tell you that, of course, inspections are happening um, at stations, at locations. More than two months into her term, Governor Healy says she's still working to find the right people for two key jobs, general manager and transportation safety chief. She says it's taken some time, but expects to make news soon. I tell you, it will be very, very soon. We are working as quickly as possible. We know how important this is. Uh, we've got to get these positions filled, and we also have to build out the greater workforce ranks. And some more troubling news. We did learn today that the T's ridership really hasn't returned to full pre-pandemic levels. In fact, it's only just over half pre-pandemic levels. Compare that with traffic, which is back up to a full rebound. We're live here in Cambridge. Charmitz Ketty, WCVV News Center 5. Charmitz, thank you for that.